boy. So here we have Mac, and we are working on his place command. So I'm just going to kind of guide him on there. We say he's all the way on the bottom and tell him to place. Uh -uh. The second I see that we're placed, he has to follow through. We do have some distractions. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. So it's going to be a lot of repetition. Uh -uh. His Mac loves to be close. Uh -uh. Uh -uh.
lots of practice when he comes home. But eventually you can build them up to um, holding this for 10, 15, maybe 20 minutes. The more you practice, the longer you'll be able to hold it. This command is really great for an office setting or when you work for home, from home, doing dishes around your house, etc. It's a great command to use when you want to send him somewhere at and just have him be content. So it's less structured than a stay. He does not have to hold a sit or down position. Uh -uh. As long as he stays on the bed, he's doing exactly what I want. So when he comes off, that's why I say that. Uh -uh. Just a little more. Don't increase uh -uh. that behavior. Place. I'm going to start over that place command anytime he breaks away. Uh -uh. Place. Good. Okay. Down the road, when he has this command down pat, you can introduce a crate safe toy or long-term treat for him to chew on or help him have the time pass faster. So that's something to keep in mind down the road when he has his down pat, uh -uh. and by down pat, I mean he can hold it for longer than 10 minutes. He can then have a long-term treat or crate safe toy just to sit on there. But right now, I want to focus on that command, building up time and becoming really strong with this. Okay. Mac, sit.
Thank you. 